Hi guys! Well, this is a reading I did for a friend of mine with the Camelot Oracle, which I got yesterday, and now I have my complete Will Worthington collection, who I love as an artist. And um, I already uh, uploaded a video about this deck and showing off the collection, but I wanted to show you how this deck actually works too. Now, this is the kind of reading you can get uh, with the Camelot Oracle. Uh, and uh, Kelly from The Truth and Story has done a video about this too. Now, how the, this deck works, you take out, you separate these cards with the uh, paths. They are eight cards. They sep you separate them from the rest of the cards, uh, which can have the, um, the heroes, the knights. And you shuffle them separately. Then you choose randomly a path. In this case, it's the determined path. And then you shuffle the cards with the um, knights and the characters. And you pick one card as a, a champion and one card as a challenger. And now you have your cards, your reading. What you do next is you take the guidebook and go to um, the um, page where the um, let me find it where the um, here it is where the determined path is described we have the green shuffle the determined path um, leads to the green shuffle and since this was a reading about love and relationship you read this meaning the paragraph and it describes on which path you are uh, in your love life. Here we have for work and creativity, well-being and inspirations, and also a general meaning. There's a description, keywords, aspects, and there's also a green chapel in meditation. After you have read that, you go to your champion, in this case, a grain. You go to the book. So the book is, you know, very essential for this um, oracle deck. Again, you have keywords, description about Igraine, and then you get Igraine is a champion, and in this reading she's a champion. So if you read the paragraph about the champion, Igraine is a champion, you get the meaning, and then you want to see what your challenger is asking you. And in this case we have, I will say Kundrie, I may sloth the name, sorry if I do. Again, you go to the, the book and then you search Kundrie asking the question for the green chapel which the determined path leads to. And she asks us, where is there space in your life right now? And this question is, you know, about self-examination and thinking about your situation along with this question. So you get the reading um, with this deck. One moment, please. My phone is ringing. Se pendo se dio lepta. So this is how this uh, this deck works. I, I really love it, and the the messages I'm getting, the readings I'm getting with this deck are really spot on and very strong. You can also use this um, deck along with other decks and have a champion again and a uh, challenger for pros and cons uh, in your reading. And you also can do the um, a big, a bigger readings using uh, the map that it is that is included, such like this one, this map, and uh, ask yourself the questions that go for um, it along with these uh, places. Uh, it's a, a very interesting deck, and I love the energy of it. 
and uh, having you know a challenger a challenger and a champion and also the path you are on ac uh, according to your uh, situation and question gives you a full grounded and complete answer or um, maybe um, guidance it makes you think about your question even more and leads you to uh, the answer you are seeking so yeah that's the um, how the Camelot Oracle works it's a really interesting deck and I love it I love that it is different um, uh, if you find a copy or if you are thinking of getting a copy get one the artwork is amazing and yeah the readings you get are also spot on and really really powerful and I mean it's you know Camelot guys it's King Arthur Merlin Morgana and all the knights so yeah I love this showing you again some of the images so yeah take care everyone hope you enjoyed it and let me know what you think